Hi guys, in this video I want to show you another filter that comes with the Gimmick plugin. This one is called Rodilius. I'm not sure if I pronounced it correctly. You're going to see it in a minute. I want to apply the effect only on the environment and leave the cat the way it is. To do that we need to make a selection and that way the filter will be applied only on part of the image. I'm going to turn on the quick mask mode. Next I'm going to select the brush tool and I'm going to switch the foreground and background colors. Adjust the size of the brush and I'm going to start painting. First with a big brush. Adjusting the size. By removing this uh, semi-transparent red color, I'm actually making a selection. So everything that I'm uncovering will be selected. I want to select the background, but it will be easier to first select the cat and then invert the selection. Also, don't worry if you go outside the cat I'm going to apply feathering to the selection to make a smooth transition between the filter effect and the cat. I reduce the size of the brush to paint on the ears. So by painting with white color and the quick mask mode you're making a selection I'm going to do the tail now A little bit more here and now I'm going to reduce the opacity of the brush click here to switch the FG and BG colors and paint with black and this will make the areas that I'm painting on now sort of semi selected and that way only part of the effect will be applied there now when this is finished I'm going to remove this and uh, turn off the quick mask mode. Then I'll go to the select menu, invert the selection. Then again select menu and this time feather. I'm going to feather with 30 pixels. Next go to filters and select the Gmic plugin. Artistic scroll down and find the Rodilius filter if I pronounce it correctly I'll change the smoothness to 1 you see how it looks in the preview window I'm not going to change the rest of the settings just click OK and now I'm going to pause here because this is going to take some time to finish When it's done, go to the select menu and choose none. And you see the effect is pretty cool. Looks like this cat is in some magic land. I also did this with another image. This time with this mushroom. I'm going to post both images on my Google Plus page. Link is in the description. So experiment with this filter. And if this video was useful, leave me a comment. Like it. If you are new to my tutorials, visit my channel and subscribe. And that's it for now. Bye.